Hey guys, Lugia Master here, and welcome to another episode of Legends of Yu-Gi-Oh's Worst. This is the series where I talk about terrible cards printed by Konami, what they do, what they can do, and what could have been done to make them better. Today I'm going to be talking about Royal Knight of the Ice Barrier. It's a level 5 water attribute, warrior effect monster with 2000 attack and defense with this effect. When this card is tribute summoned, special summon 1 Ice Coffin token, aqua type, water, level 1, attack 1000, defense 0, and attack position to your opponent's side of the field. This token cannot be tributed for a tribute summon. What can it do? What does it do? Well, it summons a token to your opponent's side of the field. That can't be used for a tribute summon. Whoop de do it's can do I even need to explain why this is terrible? We're in a format where people are using link monsters. They would just link this off. They just get rid of this right away. Free monster for them to use. Now, let me say something here, right? So first things first, let's make the attack points twenty four hundred. That way it's a little bit better. I mean, yeah. Arm Dragon level 5 is also 2400 attack points. So, that would be completely fine on this. Making the Tribute Summon a little more worth it. Now, this is where things are going to get a little bit weird. As I'm going to be giving it two fixes. One to match Master Rule 3, which is before Link Monsters. And the current Master Rule, which basically matches, you know, Link Monsters and whatnot. Because I can kind of understand the gimmick. You're supposed to summon the token to your opponent's side of the field that they can't use. And I guess you're supposed to beat over the tokens with this thing. Well, if you're going to do that for Master Rule 3, here's what the effect should say, right? Alright, make when this is Tribute Summoned, Special Summon as many... Ice Coffin Token Monsters to your opponent's side of the field as possible. These tokens cannot be used for a Tribute, Fusion Summon, or Synchro Summon. Basically, you're giving your opponent useless monsters that they cannot use at all. And you're free to beat over them. And that would automatically make it better. For the past, you know, format, you know. But if we're matching it to the Link format, here's what the effect should say. When this card is Tribute Summoned, Special Summon one Ice Coffin Token Monster to your side of the field. For the rest of the turn, you can only Special Summon Ice Barrier Monsters. Oh yeah, also, make the token a Tuner Monster. So, that makes it even better. You get an instant Synchro Summon right off the bat. Making the Tribute Summon a little bit more worth it. And yes, I gave it the restriction of you can only Special Summon <laughs> Ice Barrier Monsters for the rest of the turn. But I feel like that's only fair. As, without restriction, this would be broken. I mean, the Tribute Summon would still be slow, but the token summoning thing, yeah. Be broken just because it summons a token <laughs> but those would be my two fixes for this card one would really make it better within master rule 3 and the new one would help it work in the new master rule so if you guys like this video please leave a like comment and subscribe to join the creeper cut army let me know what cards you want me to review in the comment section below and I will see you later, recruits. Peace out.